Hi betting experts, on Thursday, February the 1st, we're off down to Somerset to win Canton on Thursday. Soft ground expected, really competitive big fields and some interesting racing. Hopefully, we found a couple of winners. We start off with our betting expert, Daily Nap, sponsored by Bet365. This goes in the 145 at Wing Canton. It's the Wing Canton Handicap Hurdle, two mile four for conditionals and amateurs that have ridden in pony races previously. Four-year-olds and upwards of class five, four grand to the winner. This looks a brilliant piece of placing for Nordic Tiger by the excellent Harry Derham and he's also booked Alice Stevens who'll be one of the top jockeys in this race although he got some competition with Freddie Gingell riding Freddie Gordon all very capable but Alice one of the better ones Nordic Tider well maiden after five career starts had one run in France not really been that strong in the market um, for Harry Derham whose horses are usually very well found when they win definitely but nonetheless Nordic Tiger's a pretty promising horse started off at Utoxta on the 8th of October, finishing a creditable fourth behind Asta La Pasta in a race that's thrown winners, then ran really well in the 17 runner Warwick Novice. Plenty of hustle and bustle there, which would be good practice for this. Two runs in handicap so far. Um, it's run with credit in defeat, although did get very tired last time out at Taunton under today's jockey, beaten nearly 17 lengths there by individual East. Um, but if you watch that run back, I think Nordic Tiger ended up miles too far back. It was a strange race that got blown apart by Freddie Fleetwood, who went well clear, stretched the field, and Nordic Tiger was dropped out in last and never really got anywhere close and then got quite tied up the straight but I'm expecting a lot better today there should be a little bit more improvement in the tank from Nordic Tigers only run five times in his life over hurdles and certainly a mark of 104 should be well within his compass I think this sharp track should suit ideally our betting expert value angle selection sponsored by bet365 goes in the 345 it's the Weatherby's Cheltenham Festival betting guide handicap chase three mile one and 30 yards a class three for five-year-olds and upwards good prize money ten and a half thousand pounds on offer and I think it's a really good opportunity for Copperhead to snap a frustrating spell of near misses Jotis are going really well at the moment four winners in the last 14 days strike rate of 19 percent Copperhead's a reliable horse He's run 15 times over fence in his life. Three wins. He goes particularly well around these sort of tracks in the West Country. He's been running well really well on all three starts since returning from 150 days off the track at Fontwell where he bumped into Sacre Coeur, a prolific mare of Dan Skelton's, ran well there clear of the rest and then a lot better than the bare result behind any news at Exeter uh, on the 24th of October, beaten 19 links in the end but up on the hammer throughout uh, and just fading, he's been dropped a pound, he has been off for 69 days but I think the key here, Freddie Gingell's booked and I think he's got a chance to lead on his own for the first time this season and that is never a bad plan of attack round Wincanton. Best of luck on Thursday, betting experts, and please remember to like and comment on all of our YouTube videos. Mm-hmm.